Joining me now are Matt Norton, Worldwide Green Lake Sales at HPE, and Ross Down, Senior Cloud Economist for Western Europe at Nutanix. Welcome to both of you. We're going to be talking about the business value of HPE GreenLake. So, Matt, if I can start with yourself, can you talk us through the general value of HPE GreenLake and what it can deliver to HPE's customers? Yeah, absolutely. Thank you, Guy. So, um, first of all, GreenLake is HPE's on-premise um, consumption of IT. For us, it's um, one of our fastest growing services, 47% year-on-year growth, $3.5 billion worth of revenue from 800 customers. So why such impressive numbers? Why such impressive growth? Well, the market is telling us that it's helping uh, deliver better time to market. Forrester Consulting said that was 65% time to market gains, 30% um, CapEx savings by moving to on-premise. And of course, HP is continuing to innovate um, in GreenLake. So we now have GreenLake Central, which again is really helping our customers put GreenLake at the heart of their cloud strategy. And Ross, what about the general value of Nutanix and what it is able to offer customers? Thanks, Guy. Um, so Nutanix solutions are built on uh, you know, hyper-converged infrastructure technology. You know, it's a complete 100% software-defined solution that integrates you know, compute, virtualization, storage, um, and security to power any application at, at, at any scale, really. Um, and Nutanix customers see significant operational and financial value from, from the solutions. You know, most notably, uh, automation is a key element to the Nutanix um, solution. You know, the intelligence of the Nutanix software defined storage um, helps to automate tasks that other vendors are unable to. You know, making it significantly quicker to deploy compute and storage resources. Um, ease of management is another uh, significant benefit to our customers. Um, the Nutanix one-click mentality through Prism interface, um, which is a single pane of glass for managing the infrastructure, makes it quicker and simpler to effectively manage and upgrade the infrastructure. You know, you add to that the freedom of choice that we provide to our customers from a hypervisor perspective, from a, from a cloud platform perspective, you know, it really does give them the, the flexibility to run workloads um, wherever a customer wants to at the most uh, efficient cost point, really. So, Matt, are there any examples that you can share with us that bring this to life? Yeah, absolutely, Guy. There's, um, we have obviously 800 customers globally. and I'm quite fortunate enough to have worked with, with many of those and listen to some of their, their stories. So I'll pick out three if I may. Um, the first one um, is a great conversation with a guy called George, who is based in Portugal. George is head of procurement. And before we started talking with him, um, he was saying the business was really 45% utilized at best with their capacity. So he put it a different way, which was half of what I buy isn't used by the business. This was a real problem for him, and um, he started to, by consuming on GreenLake, started to see utilization grow. He's now near to 100% commercially utilized, so significant advantage from him. And what he also then said is, I look at the total cost of ownership of running this new environment, my savings are far greater than 70% in the last two years. So he's a massive advocate of delivering value, um, and that's a, a financial value. If we then look at another example, we had a global bank in Canary Wharf. When I first met Ian, Ian was describing his time to provision a server as being 93 working days. That's an awfully long time in a very highly competitive marketplace. So now they have capacity on demand HPE is investing the headroom in the buffer. They can pull down new servers when the bank need it. Yet, this is giving them that far greater agility. Time to market is really key for them. They can now provision a new server in a matter of minutes. So 93 working days 
down to a matter of minutes is a fantastic agility story for, for any organization. And the final one, really lucky to, to work with a, um, a global organization that what they've been able to do with GreenLake is improve their net promoter score, really see competitive advantages in the marketplace. That's allowed them to win new business. And their viewpoint is it's supporting them grow revenue by 8% year on year. Why wouldn't you want that as an organization? Some fantastic examples, some really great wins of how customers are benefiting from GreenLake. Thanks for those examples. Um, Ross, what about yourself? Have you got any examples you can share with us? Yeah, so I mean, probably the best reference point to, to point to from an external perspective is the most recent IDC survey um, or study that's been completed um, on Nutanix. You know, that talks, um, within that study, they talked to a range of Nutanix customers about the, the business value that they'd derived from implementing the technology. You know, and, and key metrics within that study show that, you know, 53% less staff time to deploy compute resources and up to 82% less staff time to deploy storage resources. So significant time savings, which, you know, on average meant that uh, their IT infrastructure management was 58% more efficient. So, you know, that's the, the beauty of the Nutanix uh, you know, solution, effectively making IT, um, IT teams much more efficient. Um, it also, you know, has a lot less unplanned downtime, so 85% less unplanned downtime um, from implementing the technology, which has huge revenue um, implications for the organization. You know, they're, they're quicker to market, there's less downtime, which means that they're, they're adding a lot more revenue per year to their organization. Um, you know, you add to that the payback period that most of these organizations have seen, which is less than 12 months with Nutanix, and a 62% and a lower five-year total cost of ownership, um, it, you know, it's a, it's a compelling proposition. And as a cloud economist team, you know, we see this on a day-to-day -day basis working with, with our you know, customers to justify and demonstrate the TCO, um, TCO value of Nutanix. Matt, what about the joint value proposition? What do you see as the joint value proposition of HPE and Nutanix under GreenLake? So there's some really great benefits that Nutanix bring um, to the offer. And you combine that with, with GreenLake. For me, one plus one equals the power to do a lot more. Um, it means that our customers around the world are getting greater agility gains from the software and the service coming together. They're getting operational benefits that both the service and the software can deliver which is resulting in a very strong, powerful business case. It's allowing customers to make significant cost savings. It's allowing customers to drive a greater agility in their organization. But I think more importantly, it's allowing customers to put a joint Nutanix and HPE GreenLake solution very much at the heart of their um, hybrid cloud strategy. It's allowing them to really deliver huge value um, and we're seeing that time and time again as we work together around the world, delivering huge value to our customers. And Ross, from your viewpoint, what do you see as the joint value proposition? Yeah, well, I kind of see three main main reasons for the, for this. You know, um, Nutanix as an organisation has transitioned faster than expected to you know true software subscription, um, but with private cloud solutions, you know, there, there's traditionally still a, a capex component to that around the hardware. You know, and the partnership with GreenLake really does solve this problem, removing that uh, that capex um, element and aligning the you know the GreenLake and Nutanix solution more closely to the public cloud solution um, that most customers are looking for these days. You know, that opex based pay as you pay as you go, pay as you use solution um, that, that those customers are looking for. Um, you know, the second piece you know is really what we see is with most on-premise private cloud solutions, customers will over-provision the environment, you know, to make sure that they eliminate lead times and mitigate operational risk. Um, you know, Nutanix software is, is already pretty accomplished at capacity planning um, so that customers pay for what they, they want. But you combine this with GreenLake's on-demand capability, and it really does provide a compelling proposition 
um, that provides significant cost benefits to that customer. So, you know, th those those two elements combined, you know, you've then got GreenLake plus Nutanix delivering all of the operational and commercial benefits of a public cloud um, world, but in an on-premise environment where customers can better manage, you know, security concerns, control their costs, and optimize performance in a much better way. Well, Ross and Matt, thank you both very much indeed for joining us today. Thank you, Jack. Thanks, guys.